Hi, I'm Shipwreck Johnny, and I think that no matter where you stand politically, we can all agree on one thing, that we are sick of talking about politics. Also, congrats to all the newly advanced ratingless petty officers. And for all those who were passed over, don't worry. In a few short months, you have another chance to feel incredibly stupid and terrible at your job during the next exam. With that said, I thought I'd offer a little levity, and with the help of BlueJacket.com, show some ways to simulate shipboard life at home, just in case you can't do without the Navy 24-7. Step 1. Invite 60 people that you barely know to live in your house for 6 months. For added realism, instruct 8 of them to only shower once a fortnight, and another 8 to wash their clothes with the same frequency. Step 2. Empty all of your closets and install shelves 18 inches apart from one another. Congratulations! You've just made birthings! Step 3. Lower the entryway of every door or hallway 2 feet and install a trip step below. Step 4. Put a humidifier in every room of the house and fill them with a 50-50 ratio of water and lube oil for proper smell simulation. Step 5. Run a lawnmower 24-7 in your living room to simulate proper noise level. Now that we've set the ambience, let's simulate normal shipboard work. Step 1. Once every month, disassemble, inspect, and reassemble your car engine using only a 12-inch crescent wrench and a broken flathead screwdriver. Step 2. Require everyone to qualify on various appliances in the house. Dishwasher operator, blender technician, master toasterman, and so forth. Step 3. Disconnect the cable box from your TV and stare at the static for 6 hours. Every 15 minutes call out, sonar holds no contacts. Do not fall asleep. Step 4. Walk around your car for 4 hours, checking tire pressure, oil level, and fuel level every 15 minutes. Keep an accurate log of all readings. Step 5. Put on a football helmet and full pads. Tie a squirt gun to your hip and carry a pellet gun while you walk around your roof for 6 hours. Every 30 minutes, call out, all conditions normal. This is best done in the rain, at 2 a.m. But of course, the Navy is nothing without its special evolutions. Step 1. Once a week, set off every smoke alarm in your house. Then, button your shirt up to your neck, tuck your pants into your socks, Put on a face kini and run to the stove. Call out, stove manned and ready. Stand there for four hours. Do not sit down. After four hours, say stove secured and go back about your normal business. Step two. Once a week, throw your cat into the pool and shout, man overboard, port side. Rate the others on how fast they respond. Step three. Three times a day, Empty all the trash cans, sweep every room, and shine every metal surface for an hour each time. Blast the most annoying music possible to increase morale. Step 4. Before filling the car with gas, hold a meeting four hours in advance to discuss the procedure. Assemble medical personnel, safety observers, and the fire department ready with hoses two hours in advance. Be sure to thoroughly test a sample before filling up. Step 5. Periodically, have everyone dress in their Sunday best and stand in the sun, not moving a muscle, while your grandfather reads the Old Testament Book of Numbers out loud. Good times! Now, let's top it off with a proper quality of life simulation. Step 1. Every two weeks, have a toddler give you a haircut with dull sheep shears. Step 2. Spend $20,000 on a satellite TV system, but only watch Fox News and the Weather Channel. Step 3. Make steak and lobster for dinner, but steam the lobster until it has the consistency of a rubber ball. Then, cook the steak until it's mostly charcoal. Step 4. Bake a cake, propping one side of the pan three inches higher than the other. Now level it out with lard-based frosting. Step 5. Post a menu saying, T-bone steaks for dinner. Make everyone stand in line for an hour waiting. When they finally get to the kitchen, inform them that we are out of steak, but have dried salted pork or boiled hot dogs. Repeat daily until everyone gives up hope and just asks for hot dogs. 
And there you have it. You can now take all the magic and wonder of the fleet to your very own home. Thanks for watching. And a big thank you to BlueJacket.com for letting me steal, I mean, borrow, their intellectual property. Cheers!